advertised on TV and think, I have an idea for a product that could sell on television. Well, now you can share your good ideas like many others before you've seen on TV before, like this Wubble Bubble ad at the upcoming Direct Response TV Product Summit. It's a chance to get your invention in front of people who can help you market it. Russell Williams is president of Invention Home, and he's here to tell us how the summit works. Russell, good to see you. Good morning. How are you? Great. Okay, so tell us who these inventors are, because I picture you know Albert Einstein with his crazy hair in a little garage basement. Who are yeah, who are yeah. inventors today? Nowadays, uh, you know, mothers, fathers, kids, everybody really can be an inventor. Um, I mean, research has shown over the last couple of years that there's a, a big trend for consumers to solve problems. So they don't wait for the market to develop products that fit their needs. They actually go out and they develop products on their own. And has a recession helped encourage that too? People may be out of work saying, I need a job. I think so. We've seen that where people are you know, taking the initiative to create opportunity for themselves. Neat. Well, explain what your company, Invention Home, based out of Monroeville does. What we do is we work with inventors that are trying to commercialize their products so we can help them with uh, patent work, design work, um, but ultimately it's the licensing where they're trying to get in front of these companies mm -hmm. and that's where our uh, specialty is, is, is connecting the uh, inventors with companies to license the product and then it's that company that will put the uh, development into manufacturing and take it to market. Well, and that's a key because you could have a great idea, but unless you have someone to get the word out to everyone, that's it's right. not going anywhere. So this that's is right. where the summit comes into that's play. Correct. So explain how the summit works. Well, the summit is an event that we started about three years ago uh, as an opportunity to bring these inventors together uh, with um, as seen on TV companies or direct response television companies in a face-to-face -face setting. So mm -hmm. um, what we wanted to do is create something that was unique in the industry um, where um, inventors could submit directly to uh, su or pitch their products directly to six companies in one location on on one day. Wow. Um, that had never been done in the industry. And the companies they're <coughs> pitching to are the same companies that have developed these products right here now? Th that's right. So oh what my. we do is we bring in six companies and they're top companies uh, in the As Seen on TV industry uh, responsible for some great hits like the, the Snuggy, <laughs> uh, the Turbo Roaster, the Bacon Bowl, uh, Rejuvenate. So these Stops, companies we tested that on our show, Perfect Bacon. I've got the Snackies. I mean, these are all hits. They are all hits. And the companies that are attending the summit, they're coming to the summit looking for their next hit. Okay. Um, so we, what we do is we'll spend several months leading up to the summit promoting and giving inventors an opportunity to uh, submit their products for a chance to be selected uh, to the summit. So only 24 will be selected, is that right? That's correct. So um, during that time where they could they could submit their product, they can go out to the, the DRTV Product Summit website and they can submit up until September 30th. Mm -hmm. And then we have a team that goes through all of the submissions and they narrow it down to 24 inventors. And then we invite those inventors to come to the summit. Um, we bring 12 in in the morning and 12 in in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. And then the inventors actually get um, 10 minutes with each of the six companies. Wow. So they these are private meeting rooms that are set up. It's not like a panel, so they're not, mm -hmm. you know, coming and pitching to all six companies not at like one Shark time. Tank. It's not like <laughs> Shark Tank that that, you know, that they're looking to invest and give money to the inventor. Okay. They're actually going to um, meet with each of these companies. Neat. So they'll you know, it's almost like speed dating in a way. They go, they get 10 <laughs> minutes with one company, they get a little break, then they go to the next and they rotate That's through exciting. until they till they talk to all six companies. So if someone's watching and they have an invention, where in the stage do they need to be to be able to be a part of this? Well, my recommendation is if they have uh, a new idea, I would say at least a patent, if they have a patent, I would uh, recommend submitting to the summit and let the, um, the submission team and the review team make the decision on whether or not they think it's right for the summit. Okay. Um, but the types of products yeah, that they're looking types? for would be you know, it's it's the as seen on the products that are going to succeed on TV or have the highest likelihood of success. So, products that have mass consumer appeal mm. that are going to appeal to the broadest audience. Okay. You know, that has to solve a problem that the audience can can relate to pretty quickly because you only have two minutes. Mm -hmm. um, and then one that maybe would demonstrate pretty easily. So you don't have a lot of time. So if it's a complicated product. You really can't get into explanation. It's got to be able to demonstrate easily. Okay, that makes sense. And then if someone doesn't have a patent yet, that's where your company comes in year sure. round. You're working to help people with sure, that. Sure, they could contact us um, and we could help them with that. And how hard is it to get a big hit? I mean, are there you know thousands or millions that you know go through the process but are never this big? 
Uh, I don't know about millions, but <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's hard. I mean, there's, uh, you know, it's, it really depends on the consumer. There's no crystal ball yeah. uh, to predict what product is going to hit on the market. Who would have thought the Snuggie right. would have, I mean, I think it's four <laughs> or five hundred million dollars in sales now, and it's oh, a really huge goodness. hit. Oh, my goodness. But these companies, you know, they come and, and they're looking, they have criteria. You know, they're looking mm -hmm. for things that they know through experience can work on TV. But at the end of the day, they got to get the product on TV and they got to see if the consumer will relate to it and yeah. start to buy the product. Well, it sounds exciting. Russell, thanks so much for bringing this here to sure. Pittsburgh. Thank you. So the As Seen on TV event for Inventors, or the Direct Response Television Product Summit, as it's called, is coming up October 22nd at the Robert Morris University campus in Moon Township. But if you want to show your invention at the summit, you do have to register by the end of this month, September 30th. So go to the summit website to get more details. We do have that link posted for you at kdka.com slash ptl.